Hey guys, and welcome to a decision that I have been trying to resolve for quite some time. I've been having and hiring about this and I really didn't know what to do. I kept changing my mind. And uh, yes, I basically my decision was is that I used to collect all of Red Velvet <laughs> up to a certain point and then I kind of got waylaid because I kind of stopped collecting photo cards and now I'm obviously back in collecting photo card zone and I, I cannot continue to collect all the members I, I I've never had a bias in red velvet or so I thought because I love all the girls pretty equally so um <laughs> I just wanted to support all of them and be like a good fan so I was just like oh and it was really easy to begin with and then yeah, the Revy Festival thing happened and so I, if you're familiar with my collection, you'll know that I'm complete up to Rookie and then the gaps sort of start to appear and they just get progressively worse and I'm never going to be able to catch up with this and to be honest with you, I collect so many groups and stuff now, like this is my Revy Festival page, like I just don't think... Going forward, I will be able to do this. So I thought long and hard and I was just like, do you know what? I really just need to collect one member of Red Velvet. Um, as much as I love all my cards, I'm like, I really just need to, to do it. Because going forward, obviously with their next comeback, it would just be a hell of a lot easier if I just had one. So I had to do some real soul searching. Um, but the member that I have decided to collect is... Yeti. I think, like over the years, Yeti has kind of always been my bias. I kind of was torn between Yeti and Sogi. Um, but Yeri is just... I've always had a bit of a soft spot for Yeti and uh, I was looking at all the photo cards and stuff and her cards are most definitely my favourite. Um, they're so unique, they're so different every time and um, especially her finale cards with the pink hair which I know I probably got a better chance of debuting as a K-pop idol than I have of ever completing that complete collection because they're so ridiculously overpriced. But uh, we are going to try. We are going to try. So I've got a lot of gaps to fill in before then. So, um, <laughs> and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all my cards out and set up for Yeti. And then that leaves me with a whole lot of cards and what to do because I do have a lot of cards in here that I really still love. So I'm like, I don't really know what to do. None of these cards, by the way, are, uh, are sleeved because I, they've been in here for so long, apart from this Yeti. I went through and like sleeved on my uh, Yeti cards in the hopes that you wouldn't see that I haven't sleeved any of these. So, But it's fine because they're in Ultra Pound Pro and, oh, there are some that I've sleeved. So that's kind of like... I had this kind of feeling that I would maybe try and keep my favourite cards, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, we we shall see. Um, so if I just take out Yeri's cards, actually, first of all. Take out Yeri's cards, because I don't really have, like, that many. So, like, this card. I would never be able to get rid of this Wendy card. <laughs> it's like certain cards. I'm like, oh, no, I, I don't think I could ever rid myself of these. No, no. Oh, no, no, no. This is not red velvet related, but it's cute. So it's it's always kind of been with my red velvet collection. This Irene card I kind of want to keep as well. It's like one of my favourite cards ever. So pretty. So pretty. So yes, I just, I love my red velvet collection. Like I love it. And I worked so hard in it back in the day. As you can see, I did work really hard in the beginning. Um... And then, I don't know what happened, I just kind of got a bit, I didn't, like, I wasn't really into the kind of, like, collecting zone um, <laughs> that there is now. And, it, you know, I only got back into it, like, last year. And obviously I've started collecting loads of people. And Red Velvet are, like, one of my favourite groups. Um, and... I really want them to be represented in this binder, but I just cannot, I just cannot keep making these, <laughs> these kinds of things. Or like, do I just, I just, 
I was debating as to whether or not I would just do like oh, I want to keep these joy cards so they're so pretty oh my god these joy cards they're so pretty um I was just like I can complete them up to the Revy Festival and then it would just be we'll just pretend that the Revy Festival just didn't happen I was going for all these like my things in my mind and um I had to stop the video but I'm back um so I don't even know what my train of thought was what was I talking about I don't even know I think I was just talking about the mess that this collection is in because I've only got it completed up to rookie I'm like one card away from red summer but then it's just like I just never seem to like prioritize it and I just kind of think sometimes like what even is the point because I'm never going to complete this so I feel quite negative about my my red velvet collection which is not right I need to feel positive about it again I think just because I felt so like behind so yeah that's kind of like I want to feel excited about my red velvet collection again before they have their comeback I want to have like a, a focus and a goal so yeah that's what we're doing today um this is probably half this video is just going to be me taking these cards out. <laughs> it's like, ah! so I'm going to go through the rest of my cards and see which ones I want to keep. And then I suppose like after my, my Yeti collection, oh, I love this girl so much. Um, oh wow. Just put them in complete bit of all. Um, I'll kind of like do all the Yeti stuff and then kind of like, see what I've got and then ones I want to oh my good lord I keep putting all these in the wrong place um I'll see which ones I want to keep and then kind of go from there hang on a second so I keep getting interrupted oh I did put these oh. these you can see actually this is a representation of how I felt about my red velvet collection recently so many of them are not in sleeves actually none of them are in sleeves and uh I've just kind of like these are all my non <laughs> Um, we'll leave all the Sylvie and Irene stuff in the back at the minute, so, um, so yes, that's kind of all those, so we'll sort those out, um, I have written some bits and pieces down, so, yes, but for the cards that I have, so I have, obviously, pretty much all of hers up to a certain point, and then I think this is where, I've got these are all up to date, and then this is where it starts to get, a bit peak tong so yes so the way that I'm gonna do it I do like presenting my cards like in era order but like ice cream cakes only got one card so uh, I think the way that I'm gonna do it is if we have the the red <laughs> and that's the velvet and then Russian roulette We'll kind of do that and maybe have something <laughs> uh, have something else like in I don't even know I don't even know at this precise moment in time it's like almost nine o'clock at night on a Sunday I I'm just not great at decision making I'm gonna do the fillers after because I'm not even sure what I'm doing with myself so then we've got we've got um Rookie cards, and then Red Summer, and then this is where it starts to get, yeah, do you know what I mean? <laughs> like, yeah, you know what I mean. Um, so, yes, I might move this around again, I'm not even sure, but I just wanted to kind of say, I'm quite tempted to do this with black pink as well. I was watching um, a video recently and something that I've kind of been thinking about because I do add to my collection so quick. I'm like, oh, I'm going to collect this person and this person. I recently started collecting mini from Idol, which I have no regrets about, by the way. That's not what this video is about. Um, oh, I'm going to put this one here. And then, oh, no, this is number this is number number a <laughs> this is a version and then we will put 
See, it's pre-planning on my, my part because I know how disorganised I am. <laughs> um, I just feel like, you know, the more collections you you get, the less chance you will ever have of completing them. So I keep adding. And I really should just focus on completing the ones that I've already got. I mean, today I was looking at cards for people I don't collect and I'm just like, ooh. Um, so, yes. So here we go. So that is, okay, up to there. Then we've got Summer Magic. and a, So this is where it starts to get a bit like, hmm. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do now going forward. RBB. See, now that makes sense to have RBB, but I don't. Maybe we'll just have three cards here. So actually it'd be the clear card. There's a clear card. So sorry. I'm not a professional. I don't know if you've ever noticed that. Welcome to my channel of shame. Right, okay. And then we'll have RBB. So I'm quite confident about the majority of her cards. Like I feel like I've seen they're not the cheapest, like, because they're my film, but, but I feel like it's okay. It's okay, you know? It's all right. We can do this. Um, We have this, yeah, so this is for the Reve Festival. This is day one. So this must be version B. I was like, I don't even know. I literally don't even know. I wanted to put day one and two on, like, one page. And then my aim is to have all of her adorable pink cards. Finale. See this all the finale. And then we've got three cards. I'm not even sure this is gonna be. Maybe we'll just put like a guidebook version there. And then have it like this. Oh dear. If anyone offers up any advice, I would take it for sure if this looks really bad. I did not really plan this out, so. You know, we just have to wait and see. And then finale. So we've got um, scrapbook version A and B. And then there is three. Actually, we'll do it this way. Yes. Because that seems to be quite a popular thing. Um, and yeah. Do you know what? I can tell that these cards have been in these pockets for a long time. I can also tell it's quite late at night and I'm feeling quite tired because I seem to be incapable of putting little white papers in here. There we go. We've got a bit of a rhythm going on now. Lovely. Um, but yes, I just kind of feel like decision making. I am spending way too much money on buy these days. That's mostly treasure's fault, not going to lie. Uh, I am just always behind with treasure, but I'm still loving it. And that is the most important thing. Right. Okay. And then, well, I was going to use red fillers. I just have a pile of pink ones, though. So I guess for the time being, because it makes more sense to have red, but I don't have any spare red ones. So, yes. I'll tell you what I'm going to do this off camera. Right, okay. So I have... Ba -ba 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 -ba. I was like, oh, I have gone through. I just thought of, um, I'm going to put this group card. Uh, in the middle of the first page. Do I want it that way or do I want it this way? I think, I don't know why, but I always like to have them like this way. I don't know, but that's what we're going with. I don't even know if it was this way or my, in the way I used to have it, but there we go. Um, and then for like bigger stuff, I've got this one and this one, but for the time being, we're just going to leave that in there. But I wanted to kind of get this sorted so I can't, we've only got one of these left and then i think these ones should hopefully be okay i'm not too worried about i mean it's these ones i have found one on uh, makari tonight which i bought it was not too bad of a price considering how much people sell them for um whether or not i get it don't know. I'm, I always worry about these things until it actually gets confirmed. So I don't want to jinx it. So, uh, yes. And as for cards, I kind of want to keep. So, um, I kind of, I, the ones that kind of come, come out, I do kind of want to keep these two. I'm not sure about that Irene card, but I definitely want to keep the Soggy card. 
Um, I do kind of want to keep this School of Oz Soggy card, but I'm not sure. Not sure, not sure. Not definitely this one. Like, you know, just know with some cards. I kind of want to keep this Joy card as well. I definitely want to keep Miss Irene card. And this Wendy card, I've already sleeved them, so I'm kind of like, I've already made these decisions. Mm. See, Sulgi's cards are just so pretty, but some of them in the Reve Festival are really weird. There's a lot of like, one. Well, see that one there, it's really cute as well. I definitely want to keep these. Oh my god, they're so cute. Oh, Sulgi. And like, she's got a lot of cards that are like, this way. So, you know, it's a bit weird. But, uh, yeah, not sure about any of the others. Uh, this Wendy card I want to keep. <laughs> uh, they're all pretty. I, I need to just make some tough decisions. I'm kind of going to be one of these people, I think, where I'm going to be like, oh, yes, I'll sell all these cards. And then I sell them and I'm like, oh, I miss my red velvet collection. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, for the time being, we're just going to keep some cards. I... Um, We'll sort of see how we get on with how I feel about selling stuff. Um, but I'm sorry about the, like, I'm sat on my stairs and they're really creaky. So, yeah, I don't know. We've got like seven cards, so I was just like, oh, they're going to they're gonna be weird, aren't they? Like that. Oh, there's quite a lot of Wendy. Wendy and Joy. Maybe I won't keep them like that then. Maybe I just need to choose two more cards to, to like keep in here. Maybe that's what I do. I just keep, I'll probably end up just keeping them all. <laughs> um, but yeah, sorry if my arm's in the way. I'm not um, very lucid this time of night. My awareness is not great. So yes, oh, let's choose two more cards. Let's choose two later cards then. Hmm. <laughs> what era is that? RBB. Oh, I don't know. Oh, I'll make a decision off camera and I'll put something there. Or oh, maybe the Sulgi one. That's pretty cool. I like that Sulgi one. Oh, and this Joy one, actually. Yeah, there we go. Decision is made. I have made a decision. Um, yes, I'm not very good when it comes to, like, I really, when I, when I stand a girl group, I stand all the members, I just love them all, and then I try and collect them, so, like, my black pink, my black pink collection makes no sense whatsoever, I just, like, <laughs> randomly buy stuff, I need to make a decision about that one, and just, I want to be able to complete collections, and kind of go from there, so, um, yes, so those ones I'm definitely keeping, and then I'm going to go through these, and then he, I'll probably sell some of these or if anyone wants to trade any Yeti cards or anything else on my trade and sale account, I'll link it down below and you can kind of have a look and see. I'm really struggling to find my normal two pocket and four pocket sleeves on eBay. So I think this is my first realisation that I should have like admitted that she was my bias because this is Russian roulette era and I was like, oh, Yeti's is so pretty. And then I bought Yeti for Rookie and yeah just denial for a long time i love her she's so cute and she's had such a hard time so um yeah i love her it's her birthday the other day so yeah there we go anyway um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this random video of me making the decision about my red velvet collection at last um stay safe till next time ciao